welcome back to my channel and in this video today we'll be talking about a very very serious topic which is uh, color grading and which is like two steps two main steps which movies and music videos and commercials on a hollywood production levels they use this technique to create what they create so let's dive straight into the video So the two techniques which Hollywood basically use or any colorist these days use to create what they are creating is basically the first step which will be so let's come to the first step which is the glow. So here you can see it, this is my glue panel if I open a fax set you can see what's going on select output shine threshold spread and everything's going on okay I basically use soft light okay so if I just turn it off and on you pretty much see the difference don't you you see the difference right let me just create it a big okay see the difference okay you see the difference how much it creates a separation it's awesome okay um so now how do we create it so it's pretty simple okay if i just uh, delete this here okay it's gone now and i come here i alt s and here is my this will be my glue panel so I scroll here down to glow or you can also search here glow. I just push this over here. So at first doesn't make sense, right? But it will do the thing. What we'll do is first composite type and we will go to soft light. For this scene, we will do soft light because not always it does the thing, okay? And just push the threshold way down and push this back. We will just push this down, okay? Done, we are done, okay? So you see, it's almost done. See the difference. Now, there are a lot of techniques like normal add, subtract and all these. These are some of the types which you might need later on and in some situations. But in most of the cases, I use soft light because this is what is my go to. OK. And if I just show you a few examples on what the glow does here, you see. You see, this is my glow. This is my glow panel. OK. So here it is, and if I just close this, you see, you see the difference, okay? And here's the, here's the thing: the shine threshold is over here. The spread is all the way down. You do not need to push this all the way down. You might keep it over here to actually keep a, like a soft look. But I was going for a hard look because this is a terrain or the mountain car which is like going through the harsh roads. So I kept it at a, like you know a tighter form. So that was the thing just close this and now now is the part okay the second part which is a very interesting part here you see in this shot i'll be adding it but i really don't know how much of a difference it will create because uh, after all the youtube compression and all that you know so let me just add from green this is the thing this is the ultimate for film looks okay or maybe the production looks or anything anything you're going to achieve green this is like very very important so i don't really know how much you are going to see this but i will just crank it up a bit more so that you can actually see this okay i'll just increase the strength here let's increase it a bit and the green size and my and my favorite is actually the 35 mm 400t okay i do that first and then i do a bit of a custom thing so just close it and here you see the thing okay just see this thing without this and with this now i'm pushing it too hard here because i need to show you exactly how it looks on youtube but you can do uh, however the client likes or however you like it okay you can see how much of a difference it creates you see that that green looks so good so good on the thing okay so here also if i just crank this here and you see off and on it creates a very good thing okay like really really good now in some of the movies or web series like uh, the walking dead 
or maybe the Brooklyn 999 or whatever that name is I just forget it every time you can see there is so so much green that sometimes some people actually uh, misunderstand that and they think that the camera they used is a bad camera or something like that but that is not the thing this is like a professional movie technique of creating to create like literally very very good looks okay so that was it for the video use these two techniques on your videos to get to that point uh and yes this one i'll show you what it did okay this is my glow turn it off and on you see that you see how much of a difference it creates it's just it's just so much of difference that you cannot really unsee it unsee glow okay so that was it for this video i hope you liked it and if you did do drop a like and subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in the next video